Hey, what's going on, y'all? Jay from JS Films. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at NVIDIA Omniverse with ChatGPT. I am Mario Viviani from the NVIDIA Omniverse team. I'm very excited to be here to give you a demo of the new AI extension for Omniverse called Room Generator. With this extension, I'm going to show you how combining AI and APIs can really accelerate scene building. The AIs that we'll be using in these demos are GPT-4 and Deep Search. Let's imagine that we're mocking up a warehouse here. Let's start with the floor plan. I want to generate the content of a few rooms. In particular, I want to create a small warehouse here, and here I want to create a reception room for visitors of the warehouse. So let's focus on the small warehouse. I want to drop some items in here. So let's start with uh, creating a new curve from pencil. I am going to draw an area here, and this area is where the items are going to be contained. Here we go. I click enter and the area is created. Now I need just to select the curve that I create, go to generate room, and here uh, I want to add the name of the room. In this case, we already put in warehouse, and then I want to add a prompt that says add common items that can be found in a warehouse. I just need then to click this button here and the area is generated and is ready to go for dropping items in it. All I have to do is to go and click generate. So now GPT-4 will generate a list of items, connect to Deep Search and load those items in the scene. And here we go. As you can see, the items have been gracefully disposed in the scene. And we have actually a pretty good variety of items in here. Uh, we have things like uh, pallets, uh, we have uh, shelvings, we have a lot of different units in here. And we could always go and change things around, uh, we could always move those items, but you know, the layout looks actually pretty good for me. All right, so now I want to create a reception room. So let's go back to our floor plan here. And what I'm going to do is I want to create in this area here a reception. So uh, let's go to pencil. And again, I am drawing here a area where I want the items to be dropped in. Again, this time is pretty big. Here we go. Click enter. And then I am going to select this curve here and I go to generate the room uh, and I am going to call this reception and then I already prepared a prompt that says uh, this is our reception area where we greet customer at the front desk and they wait for the products in a comfortable lounge. So all is set and I just need to generate the area which is ready to go and then I go here and I click generate and we're ready to go. So again it might take a couple seconds for the AI to generate the items. And here we go. Uh, I see that the AI did actually a very good job here uh, into uh, creating the item. So let's see what we have, what we have here. Uh, it generated quite a lot of items uh, pretty accurately as well. There is a front desk and now there is, of course, it's a reception room. So it added relevant items. It added two sofas and a coffee table. And I see that it added a couple of armchairs and a uh, informative display stand. Uh, so that's actually pretty, uh, pretty good. Uh, we have a lot of different items in here. It is interesting to notice the spatial awareness of GPT-4. All the items are correctly disposed and there is a logic to the order of the items. And also all the items are disposed inside the boundaries of the area, which is actually quite impressive. The last thing that I want to show you is Deep Search and how you can use it to change this even more. Deep Search is an ecosystem of services that allows Omniverse users to search for content stored in Nucleus Server using natural language queries. 
it uses AI to search for the right assets. So for example, you can go and search for a chair and get good results as you can see here and start navigating through those. However, if you are a little bit more descriptive, for example, putting in office chair, you can get even better results. Deep search can be trained on your own data. And since GPT uses natural language too, you can see how powerful it is to combine these two technologies. And since we took advantage of deep search's abilities to uh, use natural language for search, it made sense to use it into another extension to make selections from the results. So let's see what that looks like. So let's say that we don't like one of these objects. Let's say, for example, uh, this modern sofa, uh, modern sofa one. We don't really like it. So what we're going to do is we're going to uh, zoom in on this one, and we're going to use another part of our extension, uh, which is called Deep Search Swap. And what we're going to do is we're going to use Deep Search to uh, select another sofa, uh, and this is done automatically using AI. Uh, it will again connect to our repository of items and looking for another comfortable sofa uh, using using AI. So we just, with the click of a button, again, is proposing us another, a different sofa. And if I click again, I click, I get another one. And here we go, and we can continue this way and get a lot of different uh, variations as well. Um, actually, this is the one that I that I had before, which is which is perfectly fine. But as you can see, just by using Deep Search, we can quickly iterate through it and get a lot of different variations of it. So hopefully, this demo of AI Room Generator and Deep Search gave you an idea of the power of combining AI APIs and Omniverse and building tools around it. We are very excited about what the future holds for AI and can't wait to see what tools you're going to make with it. Make sure to check out the Omniverse extension documentation and learn how to make new tools. Thanks for watching. All right, so about February this year, I had a meeting with Mario, the person in the presentation, and he was telling me about all these extensions that he was making in NVIDIA Omniverse, and this is one of them. And actually, he's doing one for like filmmaking as well. And I was like, that's a brilliant idea. Somebody's going to do it you might as well be you. And that's what I told them. So this right here is what's exciting about AI, right? So I know people are thinking about generative AI. We want a text to 3D model. That's not going to be here for a little bit. I mean, they're here, but they're not going to be that usable yet because the models are just not that good. But if you look at it another way, combining NVIDIA Omniverse with ChatGPT, you can use it to search a massive library like he did here. That we can definitely do right now. So deep search in NVIDIA Omniverse with a massive library of 3D models, you will save a lot of time. Additionally, placing those set models to your scene by just using text prompt, again, will save you a lot of time. So even though we're not in the text to 3D model that's usable right now, extensions like this right here is definitely freaking usable now that is nvidia omniverse with chat gpt and just gives you a little bit of a preview of what's to come in this freaking ai world that we're living in right now let me know in the comments below what y'all think did you think that this was a pretty cool demo um this is for real for real because i actually got to try something very similar to this back in february march so this is not fake <laughs> it is absolutely real and additionally they are gonna have uh i think a live stream about this right here i'll put the link in the description below uh but yeah good job mario i can't wait to see the iterations of this if you upgrade it or develop it a little bit more but man some pretty good stuff.